Welcome to Wonderslate. Subscribe to our Telegram channel given in the description to updates and study materials. Topic for today's quiz is India after independence. Question number 1. How can we describe the practice of untouchability? Option A. In human practice. Option B. Derogatory practice. Option C. Slur and blot on the Hindu society. Option D. All of them. The correct answer is Option D. All of them. The practice of untouchability, described as a slur and a blot on the fair name of India, was abolished. Hindu temples, previously open to only the higher castes, were thrown open to all, including the former untouchables. Question number 2. Friends and comrades, the light has gone out of our lives and there is darkness everywhere. Were the words spoken by whom? Option A. Sardar Vallabhai Patel. Option B. Dr. Rajendra Prasad. Option C. Dr. B. R. Ambedkar. Option D. Pandit Jawaharlal Nehru. The correct answer is. Option D. Pandit Jawaharlal Nehru. Question number 3. With whose help the Bhilai steel plant was set up? Option A. England. Option B. France. Option C. France. Option D. USSR. The correct answer is. Option D. USSR. The Bhilai steel plant was set up with the help of the former Soviet Union in 1959. Located in the backward rural area of Chhattisgarh, it came to be seen as an important sign of the development of modern India after independence. Question number 4. Who is known as the father of the Indian constitution? Option A. Dr. Rajendra Prasad. Option B. Dr. B. R. Ambedkar. Option C. Pandit Jawaharlal Nehru. Option D. Sardar Vallabhbhai Patel. The correct answer is. Option B. Dr. B. R. Ambedkar. Dr. B. R. Ambedkar is known as the father of the Indian constitution. He respectfully referred to as Baba Sahib, belonged to a Marathi-speaking Dalit family. A lawyer and economist, he is best known as a revered leader of the Dalits and the father of the Indian constitution. Question number 5. What was the first dam built on the Chambal River in Madhya Pradesh? Option A. What was the first dam built on the Chambal River in Madhya Pradesh? Option B. Gandhi Sagar Dam. Option C. Sardar Sarovar Dam. Option D. Govind Sagar Dam. The correct answer is Option B. Gandhi Sagar Dam. Gandhi Sagar Bandhu was the first of the four dams built on the Chambal River in Madhya Pradesh. It was completed in 1960. Question number 6. Which country formed the non aligned movement? Option A. India. Option B. Egypt. Option C. Yugoslavia. Option D. All of these. The correct answer is Option D. All of these, non alignment formed the bedrock of this foreign policy, led by statesmen from Egypt, Yugoslavia, Indonesia, Ghana, and India. Question number 7. In 1966, into which Punjab was divided? Option A. Punjab and Himachal Pradesh. Option B. Punjab and Delhi. Option C. Punjab and Chandigarh. Option D. Punjab and Haryana. The correct answer is. Option D. Punjab and Haryana. In 1966, the state of Punjab was also divided into Punjab and Haryana, the former for the Punjabi speakers those were also mostly Sikhs, 
the latter for the rest those spoke not Punjabi but versions of Haryanvi or Hindi. Question number 8. When did the new state of Andhra Pradesh came into being? Option A. 1963. Option B. 1972. Option C. 1983. Option D. 1953. The correct answer is Option D. 1953 The protests were so widespread and intense that the central government was forced to give in to the demand. Thus, on the 1st of October 1953, the new state of Andhra Pradesh came into being. Question number 9 When did the Constituent Assembly met in? Option A. Bombay Option B. New Delhi Option C. Calcutta Option D. Madras The correct answer is Option B. New Delhi The Constituent Assembly which had members from all parts of the country and from different political parties met in New Delhi. Question number 10. What is meant by universal adult franchise? Option A. Give right to vote. Option B. Give right to speech. Option C. Give right to freedom. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is. Option A. Give right to vote. Universal adult franchise meant that everybody above the age of 18 regardless any caste, class, religion, gender and race can have a right to vote. Question number 11. Which industry was set up with the help of USSR? Option A. Barani Dairy Plant. Option B. Bhilai Steel Plant. Option C. Tata Steel Plant. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is. Option B. Bhilai Steel Plant. The Bhilai Steel Plant was set up with the help of the former Soviet Union in 1959. Located in the backward rural area of Chhattisgarh, it came to be seen as an important sign of the development of modern India after independence. Question number 12. Who was appointed as chairman of the drafting committee of the constitution? Option A. Mahatma Gandhi. Option B. Jawaharlal Nehru. Option C. B. R. Ambedkar. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is. Option C. B. R. Ambedkar. Dr. B. R. Ambedkar was appointed as chairman of the drafting committee of the constitution, and under his supervision the document was finalized. Question number 13. Who was Porti Shri Ramulu? Option A. African leader. Option B. Gandhian leader. Option C. Congress leader. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is. Option B. Gandhian leader. Porti Shri Ramulu was a Gandhian leader in Andhra Pradesh. He went on a hunger strike demanding an independent state of Andhra Pradesh for the Telugu-speaking people. Question number 14. When was Planning Commission set up in India? Option A. 1900. Option B. 1920. Option C. 1960. Option D. 1950. The correct answer is Option D. 1950 Planning Commission was set up in the year 1950 in India to help design and execute suitable policies for economic development. Question number 15 Which practice was described as slur or blot on the fair name of India? Option A. Untouchability Option B. Sati Option C. Widow remarriage Option D. None of these. The correct answer is. Option A. 
untouchability untouchability was described as slur or blot on the fair name of india hindu temples previously open to only the higher castes were thrown open to all including the former untouchables question number 16 which country has recognized sinhala language as its national language option a india option b sri lanka option c japan option d all of these the correct answer is option b sri lanka sri lanka has recognized sinhala as its national language in 1956 this made sinhala the medium of instruction in all state schools and colleges in public examinations and in the courts question number 17 What promise did the Congress make in 1920s? Option A. Own nation to linguistic group. Option B. Own assembly to linguistic group. Option C. Own province to linguistic group. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is Option C. Own province to linguistic group in 1920s. The Congress promised that after independence each linguistic group would have its own province. Question number 18. What were the problems faced by India after independence? Option A. Development of the nation. Option B. Development of the nation. Option C. Both A and B. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is option C both A and B the two problems faced by India soon after independence were maintaining unity and ensuring the development of the nation question number 19 what do you understand by the term mixed economy option A international and national state option B both private sector and state option C purely government sector option D None of these The correct answer is option B both private sector and state mixed economy is an economic system having the features of both private sectors and state in this model both state government and private sector play complementary role in the developmental process question number 20 What is union list? Option A. Issue related to whole nation. Option B. Issue related to state. Option C. Issue related to central government. Option D. None of these. The correct answer is Option A. Issue related to whole nation. The subjects or issues relating to the whole nation are given in the union list. Defense and taxes are a few examples. Thank you for watching the video. If you'd like practice this quiz then download the Wonderslate app now. Link in the description below. If you have any suggestion for us feel free to leave comments. If you liked the video and want to see more of it hit the thumbs up and don't forget to click on subscribe button to get more updates of the future videos.